Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Thanks for watching. So I'm gonna take a quick little minute. I'm going to unpackage my Dr. Locks kit that I ordered in the mail. I did order the five piece kit that comes with the pre-cleanse, the shampoo, uh, the powder and not powder, oil. Mm, I don't know where I got powder from oil um but i did open the box a little bit and then i thought mm, what the heck let me do a quick unboxing video so here we go comes in a priority mailer it was a two-day shipping um it did take a little longer because of covid but we all know what's going on with that situation so with that being said let's jump right in and see what i got okay as i said i did start to open it a little bit it's packaged very very well it's inside of the priority mailer box and then also inside of a plastic priority mailer envelope and each container top is wrapped individually with with tape and priority mailing plastic so that is great so that there's no spillage because it is a little pricey so spillage is definitely not an option this is the yaya oil it says that it's a daily source of conditioner for dry scalp and locks. Yaya oil can also be used for hot oil treatments alongside the Jenna, Jenan, I'm probably mis mispronouncing that, leave-in conditioner. And then it has the website for instructions and it has all of the ingredients and everything in it I can pronounce. So that is awesome. Also, there is the leave-in conditioner. It says it's a coconut oil mix, shake well and spray evenly throughout loose hair and locks as a daily moisturizer. For grooming after washing with Janssen shampoo, spray evenly throughout locks, massage mix on scalp with fingertips using the Imani locking spray afterwards. So this is to be used before the locking spray. And as I said, this is also wrapped really good, which is great. And then there is the pre-cleanse. Um, I've been looking forward to this because I probably do need to do a deep cleanse on my locks because I have been locked for almost two years. Even though they're a little short, I had to cut some off. Long story, but anyway. So this is the pre-cleanse. It's a tea tree anti-buildup solution. Um, it says shake well before you use. Spray liberally in areas where buildup is present. Use Take a cloth or fingers to move the pre-cleanse around in the area and pull up the flakage wash locks with shampoo thoroughly and once again it does have the website and the instructions and all of the ingredients which once again i can pronounce them so this is the box i will reuse that for shipping for something later and so we're going to go ahead and we're going to open this bad boy up Okay, so it has two more products in it. The total kit together is five. Um, this is the locking spray, and it's a natural alcohol-free hold for locks. You use it after you wash it, shake well, then spray on new growth and groom locks. Works best with the leave-in conditioner. Allow locks to dry under a dryer. They will hold in place without buildup. And then there's more instructions on the website as well. Um, has water, Camelot Noble, Athium Snobilis flower, vitamin E, sugarcane, witch hazel, and lavender, and also Germa Bean 2. So, all things that I definitely can Google and pronounce. And last but not least, we have the shampoo. It's a build-up free shampoo. It is 8 ounces. Uh, the locking spray is 8 ounces. The pre-cleanse is eight ounces, the oil is four ounces, and the leave-in conditioner is four ounces as well. So I did get the whole entire kit. I can't wait to try it out. This wasn't wrapped around the top, but it is because it is, it's supposed to seal. There's a little sealing cap in there. It smells good. I can smell the lemongrass. It smells really good. So I'm excited about getting started using these products. Um, I will do a review later on how they work out for me. Like I said, it is a five kit system. It does say no sulfates, gluten-free on the pre-cleanse. So with that being said, I, like I said, look forward to using it. 
I'll give you guys an update later. I do got to learn to retwist this hair, but I'm not excited about that. But anyway, thanks again for watching. Please comment down below. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.